Happy holidays, fellow Star Citizens. Scrapshot here. I literally just finished an awesome glazed ham dinner with uh, the family and playing some board games. Uh, I'm hoping all of you had uh, had a great holiday season so far as well, no matter how you celebrate. So today I thought I'd start running through uh, several of the new missions around Crusader. Uh, so let's go ahead and, and choose this one. It's a, a delivery retrieval op mission. It's only 4,000 credits. You know, how hard can it be? Uh, and we, we got to, we got to check out one of the, the new derelict outposts on Daymar. So that sounds cool. Okay. For some reason <laughs> it's not, oh, there we go. Okay. I think it's got, I think we got it now. It's not showing up under accepted though. Let's check back in general. Yeah, it's gone there. So it must be, it must be here. I'm going to assume it's here. <laughs> So let's let's turn off the quantum drive and uh, see if I can see the the HUD marker. Yeah, there it is. All right, let's see if we can find a location close enough. Yeah, that might have to do. Oh, I'm dry's been acting up too. I, it's like it doesn't it doesn't initiate as soon as you you know hold down the B key. It, it just it's it's very sluggish, and you don't really get the audio as much anymore. Some ships I've I was it was okay, and then like here for instance, with my Avenger Titan I've got nothing. So I don't know. It's, it throws me off a little bit, but I guess we'll be okay. Let's see how far we are away. Quantum travel complete. Yeah, okay, 175 kilometers. Yeah, that's not gonna help. I think we're gonna fly 175 kilometers, so I'll uh let me straighten out here a little bit. I'll meet you on the other side when we get closer. No sense in you guys putting up with this, so... Alright. Be right back. Alright, so here we are about... A little, a, little more, a little less than 10 kilometers out. My only real concern about this is that... Uh, I don't know if this is going to be like going to a cave where, you know, you can... You've got the HUD marker right up until you get to like three kilometers, then it disappears on you. And it's not as bad during the day, or you know, when you have daylight, but at night it's a little hard. So I need to not only uh, fly straight at the HUD marker, but I gotta keep an eye, uh, keep keep an eye on the ground, make sure I don't smack into it. And I found sometimes they say, "Yeah, you got 1.2 kilometers left," and it's like, "No, no, you've got like 50 feet." So. So I'm doing a lot of scanning to make sure that, uh... Okay, here we come. I got the lights on. And let me tell you, the Avenger Titan, awesome headlights. I mean, look at this thing, it's like lighting up half the moon here. Okay, there's the, uh, there's the Daryl Dale post. Should be kind of interesting to investigate, take a look around. Uh, are those people down there? <laughs> I see two guys standing down there. That's... I thought it'd be empty. Oh, I see some people's headlights. There, you know, their torches. I guess their flashlights on their masks. I thought this. Yeah, there's another guy. I thought this would be a vacant. You know, there'd be no people here. That's not good. And I forgot to put down my landing gear. Darn it. <laughs> yeah, okay, back up a little bit and put the gear down. That's better. Well, that's that kind of changes things a little. I mean, four thousand credits for for 
pickup out here is one thing, but 4,000 plus a couple dudes, that's, that's, yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Fortunately, I came prepared. I got my trusty FS9. And my, uh, yeah, good, I still have my, um, AO3 sniper rifle, so. Hopefully we'll be able to take care of this. Makes me wish I took makes me wish I took cold arms. <laughs> Say let's run by this rock over here. See if we can get a check out what's what. It is really kind of silly that I flew up in a this <laughs> Avenger Titan completely lit up and they're just standing around like, yeah, okay. Whatever. Jeez, come on, will ya? There we go. And one more. And he stood back up. Oh, no, wait. Okay. All right. I think that's everybody. And can I see anything over there? Nah, not really. Everybody's gone from there. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to get anybody from, from this vantage point. I think I'm going to need to move to the other side of the, uh, of the outpost. So I'm going to run up here along this ridge. I've also noticed you don't, uh, you can run a lot more in the PTU than you can in the Persistent Universe. So I kind of have to stop to catch my breath as much. Man, I feel like I should be all the way around by now. <laughs> it's like, how far do I have to go here? Yeah, no, I need to go farther. Nothing there. Okay. Yeah, see, I'm still running. In the PU, I would have been passing out right here. I <laughs> uh, can't see anything still. Not really. I thought it was four guys I had to take out already. <laughs> it's like... And I know there's at least one or two over here on this side. I mean, if I normally when I'm doing these, you know, these delivery missions, I'm like, eh, I don't need a gun. Maybe I'll have a sidearm, you know, I've never used one, but. Uh, do I hear a ship coming in? Yeah. Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> okay, I guess we have reinforcements coming in. That's not good. I think I'll start bringing railguns. Jeez, look at that. I'm going to start bringing railguns with me when I come on these uh, retrieval op missions. Great. And here they come. Oh, what's going on? He's just kind of floating away. I don't see anybody getting out. I really, okay, because the other problem I have is, since I really wasn't expecting this, he should be going over there and flying flying over there and, and obliterating my uh, my Titan. But it looks like he's not going to do anything. 
So I think we'll just kind of continue along. Pretend he didn't show up. <laughs> I don't even see anybody in the uh, cockpit. Jeez, well, there's two. Okay. Oh, there's another. That looks like it. <laughs> just floating up there. It's just great. Yeah. Oh, wait. What's that? Nothing. Yeah, I'm just not seeing anybody. Okay, I guess that's everybody. So there are three over here and four on the other side of the outpost. Uh what happened to my gun? <laughs> Let's check this out. Oh, there's more dudes. And where's my gun? <laughs> okay. I've got three more. And where did my gun go again? Jeez. Wrong gun. So it looks like I have about two seconds to pull the trigger before I apparently uh, holster my gun. So, gotta make this quick. Wow, real quick. Alright, here we go. Okay, we didn't holster, that's good. Jeez, so... Five dudes over here. There's another guy, okay. And another one. Good lord. Eh, that better be everybody. Alright. I vote we get the box. And, oh, yeah, I just, I just holstered my gun again. I don't know, because I stopped. Yeah, there we go. All right, it's back in. Let's see if we can grab the box from the container from up, the package from down here. I'm sure I can't. 
Oh, can I? No, of course not. All right. Looks like we're going to jump on top of the container. All right, great. Let's go. This doesn't hurt. Okay. And now we just make a mad dash back to the uh, Titan. <laughs> Hope I got everybody. So far, so good. Really would have liked to have uh, spent some time, more time doing like uh, a little looting maybe, especially the bodies. But I really wanted to also complete this mission, uh, so maybe next time I'll run this again and we'll uh, spend more time looting. And I guess I wasn't expecting, you know, what was that like ten people at least? I mean that was that was like a bunker mission, really. Granted they were just out, staying out there in the open, but still. All right, let's set our round to Quill four. And I just turned on the quantum drive, and it didn't do anything. Yeah, the HUD's not there. Great. Oh, now we're being shot at. Okay. I woke up the uh, woke up the cutlass. <laughs> Let's get out of here at least. Hopefully, it doesn't follow us too far. Yeah, I'm not my. I just flipped out of quantum. Okay, I'm back in quantum, and I'm not getting a HUD. This really, really sucks. Alright, well... Yeah, that's, a, that's kind of a problem. Okay, well, I will figure out my HUD issue. It looks like they're not following us, so we're pretty safe, I think. Uh, I'll figure out my HUD issue, and I'll, I'll meet you over to the crew L1. Okay, so here we are at uh, crew L4. Uh, make our delivery. That's the hard part's done. Please proceed to assign landing bay. Ah, you can see the little paw prints out there that are for salvage. If we, uh, if we were interested, we can go salvage a little, I guess. Yeah, I've been flying my cutter for uh, a lot of the things I've been doing in the PTU, and I just, the landing gear won't retract, and it won't um, extend. So, and extending is almost the worst part, because when I try to land, I, I have to land on my belly. I can't, uh, yeah, let's tank up here. I can't, um... Yeah, I can't land normally. I just gotta land, land on my belly, 
and check it in that way, which is kind of silly. But hopefully they'll get, they'll get that fixed after the new year. When everybody's back, they'll do another release. Now let's grab our package. And head on over to admin. Make our delivery. If I can press the button. Uh, you know, there was no button on the, on the uh, elevator there. Eh, that's not a good sign. That means the elevator is probably not working. Let's try it again. Yeah, it's, it's, I don't hear it. Let's give it another try. I, I can hear me clicking it, but it's not coming. Uh, I really want to complete this mission. All right, we're going to try option B, which is uh, we'll go over to uh, one of the pads. Unless I can't get in my seat. Nope, there we go. That's better. back out. Oh, careful, careful. Uh, I guess I can do that. Okay. <laughs> and I'm really kind of looking the wrong way. There we go. Oh, careful, careful. Okay, this was definitely not my best takeoff. Trying to do an exterior view, I guess that's probably not very wise. All right, where's the rant? Where's the the pad at? Been here. Oh, wait, there they are. I see them. All right. I think I was here for um, the blockade a couple months ago, and I remember these. Visit I remember these pads over here. People were laying on them with their uh, with their C2s. I was like, those people are crazy, but you can do it. So I think what I'll do is I'll just kind of double park over here next to the pad and EVA over with the box and see if they're, see if we have any better luck with their uh, elevators. That should do it.
And I'll just claim this ship when we get in. So I'm not worried about closing it up or anything. Now let's see if I can stick the landing here. Oh, okay. Close enough. And I'm not seeing good things here either. Man. Let's give it a try. Yeah, this isn't looking... Oh, there we go. Oh, but no buttons. <laughs> good grief. I don't have to guess. And that's not it. Hmm. I thought the the very bottom button was like the lobby. Let's try it again. Okay, so that's not it. Let's see if we can get the next one up. Okay, all right. That's a good sign. We're moving. Okay, and no ASOP terminals. Yay! <laughs> All right. Welcome. To the ASOP <sighs> no, the never mind. System. I'm not gonna do this. Let's go on over to admin. And more elevators that are not working. Lovely. Okay, okay, well, okay. I can't remember how many levels this place has. Okay, must be only two. Because this is where we just left. Yeah, yeah it is. So I think I want the upper button. think. Yeah, there. That's better. Okay. And where's admin? Is it upstairs? I think it's upstairs. Yeah. Good thing we don't need that terminal. <laughs> and of course that one's blank too. But there's only two buttons. One is get a package and one's put a package in. Okay, so that was the wrong button. Let's try the right side. Okay. That sounds promising. There we go. Awesome. Please work, please work. Take the baggage. Awesome. Okay. There we go. Completed. Okay. Well, that is uh, that is the Daymar Derelict Outpost Retrieval Op Mission in all its glory. As you can see, the PTU uh, has quite a few bugs to clean up before we go live, but overall, the promised upgrades themselves are working. It's everything around them uh, that seemed to be a problem. Oh well. Thanks for watching, and happy holidays. Scrap Chat out.